Hi everybody, Les writing in from the Dean's Office, College of Liberal Arts. Message for all of our graduate students, whether you're a brand new student, a prospective student, and returning student. I want to start with our returning students first. Um, if you have a GRA or a GTA or on scholarship, I want you to know that your funding is safe. Um, don't worry about losing the funding. This also includes if you're going to be um, if we are still going to be online in the fall, we will work with the departments on getting your funding and so you can have your GRA ship or your GTA ship this upcoming year. If you receive research funds for this past summer and were unable to take advantage of those funds, like most students were, uh, those funding will still be available. So we'll work with you on getting a new award out. It will be in the same amount. And uh, so I don't want you to worry about the funding. If you are a new student, please be working with your graduate advisors. Please be in good contact with them. Your graduate advisor is your number one person that will have the most up-to-date information on what your department is going to be doing this fall. We still don't know. We still don't know. Um, <clears throat> but uh, there's multiple plans that are going to be followed and uh, your graduate advisor is going to be the one that's going to be telling you um, uh, how to uh, best prepare for the fall so please be in touch with them um, finally if you are thinking about applying to graduate school but you don't have all your documents ready you can't get that letter of recommendation in or uh, transcript or something of that nature maybe you can't take the GRE um, there are waivers that are in place for this term, so it's a great time to actually apply. Don't worry about deadlines yet. So um, <clears throat> contact the department you're interested in. If you're interested in any of our uh, master's level departments or even PhDs, go ahead and contact the uh, primary uh, uh, graduate advisor for that department to start the process, or you can email me. I have a funny last name, R-I-D-I-N-G-I-N, writingin at uta.edu. Hey, I hope everyone's staying safe, and we'll be talking to you again next week. Bye-bye.